Hi boys and girls, we just read about the three little pigs and now we're gonna tell the story again and I need your help. So let's do it together. Once upon a time, there were three little pigs. One, two, three. And they decided to go out into the world. The first little pig was looking for something to make his house out of. He found a man with a load of straw and he said, I know I will build my house out of straw. And he did. Ah, I love my house, he said. Well, along came a hungry wolf who said, little pig, little pig, let me in. What did the pig say? <gasps> he said, by the hair on my chinny chin chin. The wolf said, well then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. And he did. Oh no, and the little pig had to run away and hide. Well, the next little pig was looking for something to build his house out of. And he found a man who was selling sticks. He bought the sticks and he built himself a beautiful house made of sticks. Oh, I love my house, he said. Well, that hungry wolf came back and he said, little pig, little pig, let me in. What did the pig say? Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. Then I'll puff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. Everybody, let's huff and puff. to run and hide. Ooh, that wolf was angry. Oh, I want to eat a pig. So he ran away back home. Well, the third pig decided he would wait until he found just the right thing to build his house. Hmm, straw? No, thank you. Sticks? Mm -mm. I'm waiting for bricks. Well, a man came selling bricks and that little pig worked day and night and day and night and he made the most beautiful house he could out of bricks. <gasps> Look at my house, it's perfect, he said. Well, here comes the wolf and he says, little pig, little pig, let me in. Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. So the wolf, he huffed <gasps> and he puffed. <gasps> And he huffed, and he puffed, and he huffed, and he puffed. Oh, he got so mad. And while he was huffing and puffing, the pig's brothers came. Hi, can we live with you? Your house is so nice and sturdy. Okay, sure. The wolf decided, that's it. I'm coming down the chimney and I'm going to eat you up. The pigs thought quickly, quickly, get a pot with some very hot water and put it on the fire under the chimney. So they did that. The wolf climbed to the tippy top of the house. Here I come to eat you up. And into the pot he went. And the piggies had wolf's stew that night. And they lived happily ever after. The end. Next time, we'll do a different story. Maybe you can have some fun and be the wolf at home or be a piggy and act it out with somebody at your house. Bye.